Hi there, this is James from Mode Lighting, and in this video we're going to cover the basics of Tiger programming. Okay, first things first, we're going to cover default operation. Out of the box, the processor should be on 001, the plate will be controlling zone 1, and the default operation will be button 1 will be 90%, button 2, 75%, button 3, 50%, button 4, 25%, and there will be an all off and an all on at the bottom. If you need to edit any of the levels of the circuits, you will have to go into programming mode. To enter programming mode, press and hold the bottom two buttons and then type 2121. When you enter programming mode, the plate will go straight to what scene you wish to edit. At this point, select the scene you wish to edit. Next, press the bottom two buttons and then press 2. You'll now be able to select what channel you wish to edit. This is done with double digits, so 0, 1 will give you channel 1 and 0, 5 will give you channel 5, for example. Select the channel you wish to edit the level for. Next, press the bottom two buttons and then number 3. The current level of the channel will be shown going from 99 to 00 for off. Select the level you wish to try for the lights. Example, 35, 35%. And if that channel's lights are then dimmed to the level you like, you can move on to the next channel. To do this, you press and hold the bottom two buttons and then number two, bringing you back to selecting the channel you wish to edit. Then choose another channel and then press and hold the bottom two buttons and number three to also then change the level for this new circuit. Repeat for as many channels as you need to, to get the levels as desired. If you need to change the fade time of a scene, press and hold the bottom two buttons and number four. You then have a fade rate of seconds. The default is 05 for five seconds, and you can increase this number as needed. If you wish to copy a scene, example scene four to scene five, and then edit your levels, you do this by going, by pressing the bottom two buttons and number one, and then selecting the scene you want to edit, in this example, number five, then press and hold the bottom two buttons and then number seven, and then next will be to select the scene that you wish to have a copy of, in this case, number four. If you then press and hold the bottom two buttons and number eight to cancel out of programming mode, you will see that those two are now a copy, and then you could edit from there onwards. And if you have a single zone system, this would be all the basics required for programming. Thank you for listening. And please like and subscribe for more content.